Let's go get our licenses. <laughs> Hopefully we won't have to wait too long. We made it to South Dakota. We did. We're in the parking lot. Three, two, one, action. We're done. <laughs> we were in, grabbed a ticket, sat down. And I was called. And he was called, and then I was called right after. It was fast. It was. It was. Very happy. The website says appointments are preferred, and I'm sure that's for their benefit. Uh, but we got in at about 8 o'clock this morning or so, and I think we're out at about 8.30. It's, it's 8.40. 8.40. So licenses are renewed. Uh, make sure if you're gonna renew your driver's license, uh, especially in South Dakota, make sure you read all of the fine print about what you need. I, I thought, I really thought I was prepared. I had our affidavits, I had, I had everything. I had my DD-214, everything was ready to go. And he said, do you have a receipt for your mailbox package. And I went, uh, nope. nope. And he goes, do you have a piece of mail with your name and address on it? And I went, uh, nope. And fortunately, he was nice enough to say, is your vehicle registered at the same address? I said, yes. He says, go get your registration. So I did, both our names were on it and that was sufficient. So anyway, just read all the fine print. Make sure you have everything ready to go. And if you forget your checkbook. Oh yeah. Like he did. Go. They do take credit cards, but there's a $2 fee. Yeah. But we did it together, so it should be just one. No, I think they charge us $2 twice. Oh. It's all right. That's all right. Uh, it was my mistake. I didn't bring the checkbook. I yeah. meant to bring the checkbook. So checkbook, cash, or credit card with a fee. So yeah. anyway. So be prepared. Golly. <laughs> We thought we were. We were so excited. I think we were just so excited to get in that we didn't even think about that stuff. I didn't even have time to sit down. I got my no. ticket and went to sit down and they called me. And don't bring drinks or food. No, no drinks or food inside. Yeah. All right. So we've got to go back now and pick up our mail because we asked for our mail to be picked up today and uh, we'll go through it. Load the car. Load the car and get ready to hit the road again tomorrow. Yeah, we have all day. We do. This is nice. We do. All right, down the road. All right. Did you enjoy your stay? Yeah, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. We had nice neighbors. A little, a little noisy off the freeway. It was, but I, I didn't, it, I, maybe I'm used to it. You know, yeah. There's always a train, freeway next to you, you know, and all the RV parks and everything. So, no, that's good. So it's another travel day. We had two days down. That was actually kind of nice. It was, it, yeah, it broke it up. Yeah. Because Yeah. travel day after day after day gets a little wearing on you. So two days in Rapid City, South Dakota. Got our new, or we renewed our driver's licenses. Picked up our mail. You guys, it was so easy. Yeah, it was. We were expecting to be there all day. Yep. And, I mean, we sat down, his number was called. Yep. And then mine was right after, so it was... It was good. Go early. So we're hitting the day today, hitting the road today. Uh, it looks like we're going to have a headwind on our way towards Billings, but uh, we'll get on the road and see what it looks like. We got to go anyway, right? We do. <laughs> One step closer to Montana. That's right. And I'm excited for that. On our way. Yeah. Weather's been good though. It has. Yeah. Is cool. it supposed to rain today at yeah, all? Yeah, it's supposed to rain today. Okay, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. We need the rain. All right, down the road we go. We gotta go, don't wanna be stranded. We got the world waiting. Yeah, you know, you'll never have to worry. I'll keep you close to me. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Never mind all the things that try to shake us down. I know we tripped and fell. It's time to get back up now. Here and there and everywhere, we'll take it all in. We got a life to live.
so lose your head when I think of being with you. Nobody else I need, it's true. You radiate everything I need. Got me living like a fly in a big old tree, yeah. If we get lost in the crowd, uh, we'll shout out loud. Oh yeah, we'll shout out loud. Let's make sure that they can hear us now. That was a tough day. Yeah, it was. It was super windy. It's still super windy. Yeah. Hopefully this audio will come out okay. But we, we made it. We made it to Billings. Made it to Billings. Um, it rained. It blew. It blew. It blew. It blew. Mm -hmm. It rained. It just did everything. So we are going to run into Sam's real quick and grab some groceries. Hey. And then we're going to have some dinner and then spend the night at Cabela's. Yes. And we need to go to Cabela's too. And we, we need gotta, to go to Cabela's. We need to go see what they've got. Yep. All right, let's get in because it's, right. oh, it's cold. Oh, man. It's cold. How'd you sleep? I slept pretty good. You slept really good. Did you? Good. Yeah, even though we were just a little bit off of level. Mm -hmm. That didn't bother me. That bed is so stinking comfortable. <laughs> I'm grateful. Love that bed. Love that bed. All right, so we woke up this morning. I woke up and looked outside and we had a gazillion cars around us. Yeah, I think they had a meeting. <laughs> I think they're still having a meeting. We had, there's a lot of Red Bull cars and... Yeah, Cabela's is right next to Sam's Club and so we, uh, we woke up to a bunch of cars around us. <laughs> so we need to get out of here. Yeah. Need to get on the road. We've overstayed our, our welcome. We have overstayed our welcome. Time to hit the road and I think I'm gonna top off the fuel in Missoula on our way. So, let's go. I haven't had my coffee yet. Oh my goodness, you haven't had your coffee yet? And it's 7.30. I've been getting stuff done. Goodness sakes.
What an absolutely beautiful day. It is. Just got into a little bit of wind, but uh, not nothing like yesterday. Oh no, not at all. Yesterday was awful. Okay, I want to sh turn this around so you guys can see what we're seeing. Yep, it's just absolutely a beautiful it's, travel day. Isn't that just amazing? So you slept good last night? Yeah, I slept pretty good. We stayed at Cabela's in uh, Billings, Montana. And uh, it's always a good stop for us. It's kind of our go-to stop. Yeah, and right in the same parking lot is Sam's Club. Yep. So we went over there and spent a little bit of money. Yeah, well, <laughs> it's grocery time, so. Yeah. Boy, the wind really kicked up here. Uh, we are, sheesh. Wow, look at that view. Yeah, so we're showing up in Montana a couple weeks earlier than we normally do, and uh, I'm glad they got the snowpack in the mountains this year because yes. that will help with the the drought uh, going on across the country. Hopefully, so we're gonna get in. We gotta top off our fuel. Uh, we haven't put fuel in since Norton, Kansas. That's right. So we're gonna go ahead and top off our fuel because it's the least expensive here. We're going to go to Spokane and then we're going to go to the West Coast Rally and uh, we got some stuff coming up and we're going to share that with you. So anyway, we're going to get on down the road. We are just, oh, being back in Montana is it makes, wonderful. It makes me so happy. It does. <laughs> it's so beautiful here. Big smile. Oh my god. And gosh. a great travel day. Yes. So down the road we go. Here we go. I'll wait to see your Together 
Well, I'm ready to be back in Montana. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I'm happy to be back in Montana. Yep. Look at this. Check know, this out. This. We are so excited to be back in the forest and the trees and the mountains. And the weather's been perfect. The weather's been good. We even got some little bit of thunder going. We did. We did. Love it. It's fun. So we've made it back to our place in Montana. Uh, for those of you that don't know, we have an RV lot in western Montana and we kind of come and go to the lot uh, throughout the summer. We do. And we have a lot of friends here with RV lots. We do. And we get to hang out with them. Makes it so much fun. Um, so we're here. We made it safe. It was a great travel day. It was. It was. It and was beautiful. beautiful scenery. Oh my gosh. Absolutely gorgeous. If you've never been to Montana, oh my gosh, I hope you guys get a chance to. It's just stunning. It is. So we made it back to our lot here in Montana. Uh, we've already made a short trip. We were here just for a short time and then we packed up and we went to Spokane because Mother's Day yeah. And we, Kelly got to spend. You no, know, I got to spend time with my kids. On was, Mother's Day. On Mother's Day. And that hasn't been, I don't even know the last time I got to spend it with them. And so. I got to spend time with my mom yeah. who lives in Spokane on Mother's Day. Yes, it was just a fantastic day. It was. It was just, it was perfect. And now we're back in Montana and we have got projects. Oh my gosh, have we got projects. We have <laughs> we been have going, going, going ever yeah. since we've been here. We haven't even seen our friends no. Since we've been here, no. it's, well, we've only been here a day, but. So we're going to share some of our projects we got going on. We got a, we got a bunch of stuff going on. Um, yeah, I'm not even going to make the list. I'm just going <laughs> to, I'm not even going to go into it. We'll just we'll take you along with us when yeah. we, as we do it. Yeah, we got a lot going on. And then we got a rally coming up in Boise, the West Coast Rally coming up in Boise. Mm -hmm. uh, that's coming up soon, and we've got some exciting news. We're going down to Salt Lake uh, to meet with a company down in Salt Lake, and mm -hmm. we'll, we'll, you know, share that with you. So, we, man, we got a busy summer. We do. Oh. I hope we can get it all done. So, anyway, we made it back to Montana. We're having a blast, and we're going to share some more stuff with you uh, later on down the road. So, we're going to wrap it up from Superior, Montana. It all starts with an idea. And turn those ideas into reality, and they become memories, lifelong memories, guys. Absolutely. We'll talk to you next week. Bye. Bye-bye.